what we need. A small pond or anything what could hold water like this. This is going to be reused. We haven't just got it from the shops plain. We bought it with lots of fat balls. And then we used all of them for the birds and we emptied it. And now we have space to make a pond for it with it. Even though it's plastic, it, is a, it can hold water. And we have some water plants. I suggest this is water grass because it looks more like our grass. And this is another plant. As well, we're using a coconut. And you may think this is heavy. It's really a stone. Let's dig! First, what I suggest we can do is make a border. So it's just the right size for the pond to get in. How's this? Finished! We're digging a nice big hole. Just about the size of this. and 
And now with this stick, we're going to make, put it like this, and maybe a bird just could sit on it. We have high chances we may get rain wobblers because normally they sit on areas near water and this is like a perfect place and they normally sit on upright leaves or they could sit on here, they could sit on here but they could sit right here. This is a gigantic biodiversity you can create in a space you can make even smaller than where I am. You can make a pond any size. Even in a small area like where I am, you can make a pond like what we just did. And it's a big biodiversity for all these little creatures such as reed wobblers. And sometimes we may get dodges just sitting around here to get a drink. We could get many different small birds, or even some big birds getting a drink over here. So what creatures can we find in the water? We could find water boatsmen, great diving beetles, all like those little creatures that can swim. And you may find lots of aquatic birds sitting somewhere near so they can get a drink and they can like find their prey what may be able to swim they can hide somewhere like you could hide here a safe place for them we could get some dragonflies damselflies damselflies may sit on here dragonflies may go in here or there, anywhere where there's a space to sit for their long legs. We have more than one pond and we're starting from here. Here is a pond. This is the first pond we had. Right over here. We have three ponds. So we have four already. jelly coating if there's any animals like a small creature or wants to snack on one of these they would they, when they even touch the jelly they were like yeah that's a horrible taste I don't want to eat that and soon we may get loot frogs toads or other stuff what are real what have these eggs? 